Among the long, long list of available technologies are four critical ones that you'll only find on the Nora model. Blind spot intervention, backup collision intervention, predictive forward collision warning, and our innovative around view monitor with moving object detection. This new Armada is designed to satisfy both the functional and emotional needs of our buyers. Three well-equipped models will be available, SV, SL, and Flatter, in two-wheel and all-wheel drive when it goes on sale this summer. While it is too early to announce pricing, I can assure you that we will continue Armada's outstanding value position. One last thing, Armada's V8 engines will continue to come from our Decker MC engine plan, but vehicle assembly shifts to QU Japan. This move frees up space in our Camp Mississippi facility for the quickly expanding Nissan Titan lineup. As we previously announced, we're following up the highly successful debut of the Titan XD crew cab with a full range of bodies, beds, and engines. And we need the line capacity to assemble. In fact, we'll be talking more about this tomorrow morning. In calendar year 2015, Nissan made remarkable progress towards our goal of 10% U.S. market share. This new Armada, like the 2016 Titan, will help in that pursuit. The last thing I want to mention this evening is that our trio is our trio of winter warriors. In Detroit last month, we unveiled our Titan Warrior concept, an extreme rendition of a production Titan XT. Here in Chicago, we're continuing our extreme theme, taking our highly capable all-wheel drive Pathfinder, Murano, and Rogue to another level all together. A couple of the Winter Warriors will be on display at the show starting tomorrow. I hope you'll check them out when you have a chance. Nissan's aggressive program of product introductions will continue in late March with another major product announcement at the New York Auto Show. I hope you'll join us. Now, I invite you to take a closer look at the all-new 